I am a firm believer of stealth over strength. For example, you could spend days, hours, weeks grinding to become the best player on the server. You have all the best armor, the best weapons, you stacked on potions, gapples, totems, the whole lot. Yes, that is a gun. But all it takes is one well-placed trap to completely ruin all those hours you spent grinding. Not even the strongest player is safe from a stealthy, well-timed attack. And this is the problem with most slimestone weapons. Yeah, they're strong, they're powerful, and they do a lot of damage. But if you see one heading towards you, you're going to do something about it, which is already a problem. What's the use of a powerful weapon if you can easily stop it? So if you can make a weapon that could evade my enemies until it strikes, that would be the ultimate form of modern warfare. So I set out to design a weapon that would employ the principle of stealth over strength. And here's what I've come up with. This weapon is the epitome of this philosophy. Designed to cruise at build height, it renders the bomber completely invisible. Literally. Minecraft won't render this thing unless you're actively trying to set your computer on fire, or you live on the tallest building on earth. I want to remind you guys that this is a stealth bomber despite the deafening sound of pistons behind me. So that, here's the, here's how this thing works. I can't, I, this thing has to shut up. Okay, I get focused now. There's three main parts that make this missile work. First part is the engine, and fun fact, this is actually the first engine that was developed in Slimestone, so it's like taking a propeller and using it to fly a B2 stealth bomber. So yeah, this thing is responsible for pushing the whole thing forward. Then we have the timer and the ignition system. Uh, and the way this works is by using three different piston feed tapes. And they're all of a different length, which means that for most of the time, all three of these blocks are going to desync. The observer, the piston, and the uh, solid block. If they're not together, the piston won't power. But after a certain amount of blocks, in this case it's about 2000, they will link up together and it will cause the piston to activate. No, 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 no. I, I don't know what this is saying. Cut it out. Cut it out. This is my original idea. This is my original idea. And when the piston activates, it will pull out this block. It can't move this block because it will have to move all the slime. And that's past the piston push limit. But once it reaches this block, it will be able to pull it out and drop everything onto your unsuspecting victim down below. Greetings ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our air show. Today we will be showcasing the next generation of stealth bomber. By integrating Cube Panzer's feed tape technology into a bomber system, we have created a weapon capable of striking enemies with precision accuracy, all while flying under the radar, or above the radar to be technically correct. And without further ado, let's get started. Initiate launch sequence. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Bye bye. Wait, so all you have to do is increase the render distance to see it? That's kind of lame. Hippity hoppity, your knees are my property.